Historic rainfall is causing rivers to swell in parts of the Midwest. I think the term people are using is unprecedented. In Minnesota, Governor Tim Walz activating the National Guard to help residents in Waterville, while officials kept a close eye on possible dam breaches in low-lying areas. Minnesotans are tough and our communities are strong and we will get through this together. Aerial video shows the extent of devastation in Iowa, where Governor Kim Reynolds declared a disaster for 21 counties. At this time, it's estimated that uh, at least 1,900 properties are impacted and hundreds have been destroyed. In the town of Spencer, streets have turned into rivers, leaving residents with nowhere to go. All this water is from a historic crest from this river that's moved well beyond the bridge. You can see it's covered this entire stretch. Many businesses, there are neighbors on each side. And in South Dakota, at least one person was killed after heavy rains and flooding inundated the eastern part of the state. And floodwaters there continue to pose a threat. Officials in affected areas are working with the federal government to deliver assistance to hard hit areas as the severe weather threat shifts east. Jonah Kaplan, CBS News, Spencer, Iowa.